This answer is powered by AskQuesty.com. Get help with your Squarespace questions or tasks on demand. So today we'll be looking at how to change the banner image that shows on your template for just mobile devices. And this is the five template. So on the desktop view, you'll see this um, large background here with the windows. But when you're viewing the site from a mobile device, you'll see another image as the background or the banner. So I'll show you how to get that done. So by default, um, the desktop view and the mobile view are the same, but we're gonna fix that now. So the first step would be to go into the back end of the site, let's minimize here. We're gonna go into design, then click on custom CSS. So the first thing we'll do is to upload our banner image that we're gonna apply just for mobile. So to do that, we'll click manage custom files. You click add images or fonts, and then you select the image that you wanna upload. So in this case, we've already done it. Um, once you click on the image, it appears here. So next you'll add our CSS code. So the first step would be to type at media max width 768 pixels and our opening and closing curly braces. And what that does is to apply the CSS that we're gonna enter between these curly braces only at the breakpoint 768. So on devices, small devices, which are less than 768 pixels wide, this code will apply. And 768 is the standard really for targeting mobile devices. So the first thing we'll do is to hide the image for desktop, sorry, hide the desktop image for mobile devices. So we'll type hashtag banner dash area dash wrapper hashtag page dash sum IMG for image. And then here we have our open and closing braces. And right between those, we'll type display none. Next, what we'll do is to introduce our mobile banner. So we'll type banner dash area dash wrapper hashtag page dash sum. It should have been a hashtag. And right between our open and closing braces, we'll type background dash image colon url and we'll add our opening and closing brackets and between those we'll use the double quotes and we'll leave that blank for now add our semicolon at the end and then on the next line we'll add background size cover so the background should cover the entire screen that's it so next we need to add our image right between these two um quotes so we'll click on Manage Custom Files, and we'll click on the image that we uploaded. And then we'll just click up here to clear that away. And as you can see, it adds the URL for the image right between our um, quotes. And once that's done, once that's done, you'll just hit Save, and then we can test it out. So this is the desktop view, which is perfect. And then as you minimize the screen, there. Once it's less than 768 pixels, our mobile menu, our mobile banner will kick in, and this is what it'll look like. All right, so that's it. Was this helpful? Ask a Squarespace question now. AskQuesty.com.